good afternoon today i am going to teach you next this is the viral disease and name of that disease is the yellow vein mosaic of bendy the bendy it is also known as okra or lady's finger and the botanical name of the bendy is hibiscus esculentus hibiscus esculentus is its botanical name or it is also known as the avellumoscus esculentus the bendy uh, the yellow vein mosaic of bendy is studied or uh, that is the introduction of this yellow vein mosaic of bendy then uh, disease cycle transmission causal organism and the control measures of this disease the bendy is a popular vegetable and it is cultivated because of rich iron content and it has high nutritive value the disease yellow vein mosaic was first reported by the scientist his uh, kulkar named kulkarni in 1944 later on several experiments by varma in 1950 then later on jaha and mesra in 1955 cleared the picture of the disease this disease is known as yellow vein mosaic of bendy it is known as yellow vein mosaic mosaic means you know the mosaic mosaic tiles mosaic tiles kon bagitle asal tyachavarti jashi nakshi aste tase he je leaf hai tyachavarti alternate green and yellow green normal areas and yellow that is the infected areas that is green and yellowish areas they are alternating with each other and here the this disease is known as mosaic disease because on the leaf the infection can be takes place that is the yellow areas they can be formed and alternate with the green areas here is the patches they can be observed this is the pattern that is mosaic pattern that is yellow green yellow green yellow these are the alternate mosaic pattern like that the such pattern they can be formed on the infected leaves and there is yellow and green patches they can be formed on the infected leaf and therefore they are known as the yellow vein mosaic of bendy there is alternate green area and infected yellow area they alternate with each other and they can shows the mosaic pattern and they are alternate with one another therefore the disease is known as the yellow vein mosaic of bendy then <coughs> the symptoms of the disease which symptoms they can be observed on the plants the symptoms observed that is first symptom observed the stunting of the plant what is stunting stunting means reduction of the size of the plants growth of the plant is arrested growth of the plant is stopped it is known as stunting and stunting of the plants can be also takes place another symptoms observed that is chlorosis chlorosis that is there is a destruction of chlorophyll near the veins and veinlets can be takes place the chlorophyll near the veins and veinlets they become so destroyed these are the veins and this is the veinlets and the chlorophyll near the veins and veinlets they get destroyed and yellow patches they can be formed the veins can be easily observed due to clearing of the veins and veinlets the clearing of the veins and veinlets the veins they can destruction of the chlorophyll these veins and these are the veinlets they can be clearly observed due to this infection then at the final stage chlorophyll between two veinlets get destroyed and perfect mosaic pattern they can be also formed then thickening of the veins takes place 
these veins they becomes very thick thickening of the veins can be takes place and here in this area the chlorophyll they can be totally destroyed the symptoms are observed on the fruits also the skin of the fruits becomes rough and tough then size of the fruit is also reduced sometimes the fruit the tip of the fruits they get curved and the uh, <coughs> fruit becomes uh, withered and it is the tip they becomes curved and automatically the yield can be also reduced sometimes the infection can be takes place in early stage the blossoms as well as flowers they can be dropped down during the young condition also and fruit becomes yellowish the growth of the fruit is also arrested the tip of the fruit get curved skin of the fruit become rough tough and hard and fruits are dark and mal formed and the fruits number of fruits they becomes reduced so these are the several symptoms they can be observed on the infected plants also then next part is the causal virus or causal organism here the disease is a viral disease and the disease causing virus is here the hibiscus virus first hibiscus virus first is the causal organism or it is a causal organ uh, causal virus or organism this is the old name now new recent name of that virus is the monoparotide bigomo bigomo virus monoparotide bigomo virus this is the recent virus name of that virus it can also responsible for causing the disease and yellow vein mosaic is a causal agent the it is also called as the viscous virus plus or monoparotide bigomovi virus the about this virus there is not much known but kapoor and varma shown that this virus it can be transmittable by the sap also and the it can be also transmitted by the grafting also but in bendy the grafting is not done so this is the causal virus that is hibiscus virus first or monoparotide bigomovi virus then this is cycle or transmission of the pathogen or transmission of the viruses the disease cycle the transfer of the viruses or the causal agent from one plant to another plant from the diseased plant to the healthy plant it is also known as transmission or disease cycle the virus can be transmitted by the white flies and white fly the name of that white fly is the pinicia tedesi the name of that white fly is pinicia tedesi and the pinicia tedesi it is a white fly and it can transfer the viruses with their help of the saliva this pinicia tedesi they can suck the sap with the help of their proboscis on the diseased plant and when this same carrier fly that is pinicia tedesi they can visit to the healthy plant at that time the viruses they can be transferred through their saliva and they can inject their proboscis to the healthy plants and the viruses they can be transferred from the diseased plant to the healthy plant and the name of that white fly is the denesia tabesi and last point is the control how the disease can be controlled the disease can be controlled by growing the improved varieties of the bendi that is name of that variety is the pusa savani Pusa Savani, it is the improved variety in Bhendi, and by cultivation of this variety, the disease can be also controlled. Then it is more resistant. Then growing of the 
other other resistance varieties like the parvani kranti then arka abhay varsha upahar then arka anamika these are the disease resistance varieties of bhendi then protection of the crop from white flies and other insects by spraying of the chemicals like the polydon 0.3% dimacron roger ecatox are also effective according to the shastri and destruction of the collateral host <coughs> another control that is the for controlling this the proper distance can be also maintained the proper distance and to get full sunlight and aeration for this purpose the proper distance can be also maintained proper spacing can be also maintained to avoid the disease also then to avoid the sowing the susceptible varieties during the summer season then the white fly activity is also high at when the at that time when activities of the white fly is more at that time the susceptible variety cannot be grown and in this way the disease can be controlled so <clears throat> this is about the yellow vein mosaic of bhendi